what's up y'all thanks and welcome back to my channel today we are making a healthy version of tuna salad except we're using salmon but you can use it for tuna too but this is a recipe that i have been using uh since i want to say early january and let me tell you guys the snatch is freaking real so if you haven't make sure you like comment and subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you can tune in for all the healthy tips i got for you guys to snatch that waste here's everything that you will need for today's recipe yes we're gonna make this really simple you're gonna need the wild caught salmon in the packs for seasonings, you're going to need Italian seasoning, parsley, black pepper, a little bit of Himalayan sea salt. You're going to need the spray um, olive oil or the uh, regular virgin olive oil. Sicilian is great if you have access to it. You're going to need some dried cranberries. Um, I have my onions already cut up. You're going to need some lemon and you're going to need some balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar, not vinaigrette, okay? I say this purposely and you are going to need some blue cheese and whatever your leafy greens of choice will be. Yeah. All right. So first, <laughs> so first we are going to get our salmon packs. Remember you want to get the wild court one. All right. So what we're going to do first is we're going to take these. We're going to drain them out. Now, because this is going to last me, what is it, Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I only prep for like a couple couple of days straight. Um, we're going to make these two packs at a time just so that it has the right amount of seasoning and then you prep you pack it for that day. And it's a go-to snack that you'll always have or meal. Um, I actually have this with a big ass salad. I have at least one big ass salad a day two protein shakes, and then uh, I have my choice of breakfast. So anyway, one day I'll do, I'll actually do a, what is it, what I eat in a day? Yeah, but <laughs> right now I wanted to share this with you guys. So let's get our packets and let's drain them first and then put them in the bowl, okay? All right, we got, we got two drink. I better not have another man down, okay? All right, so we are going to, wait, I want you guys to like, oops, sorry. I want you guys to see this see what's happening okay so that's one pack and then we're going to put the second one i'm just like shaking it out but i guess it would be smarter to get a fork so let me go let's see here oh here we are here we are all right so we got two packs in here and then we're just going to break it up first like so. And then we get into the bun seasonings. Okay. And then it's going to be real quick from there. Okay. What you're going to need is now one tablespoon of the olive oil. I'm using Sicilian. You can use whatever you have around the house. No biggie. Now you're going to do two tablespoons of the balsamic vinegar again not vinaigrette you get balsamic vinegar from almost any supermarket i got this from aldi so one and two all right right after that right after that we're gonna go ahead and we are going to oh not the lemon yet we're gonna go ahead and season so i want you to add your parsley See, why is giving me issues? Oh, no. I'm not trying to break a nail, darling. A little bit of pepper. A little bit of salt. Don't get too crazy. Couple of cracks, right? And then you really want to go hand with this Italian seasoning because this is what's going to like really make it or break it. This does not have salt in it. So, yeah, any Italian blend you have will be su sufficient. Then you're going to take... A lemon and you're going to squeeze it in yes darling now i don't care about the seeds some of you might so if you get some seeds that falls out maybe just use the regular lemon juice um that's already made um i like to squeeze it right on the spot and then what we're going to do is add some delicious onions here so i take like a handful again i'm going to be making like two more batches of this and then what you're going to do is you're going to mix it all together. 
and it's gonna have this lovely coloring. Oh my God, it's my favorite. Y'all, when y'all taste this, it's gonna be so crunchy and light. And if you guys have like a, my onions came out really stringy today, which is fine. I'm not a big, I don't care how it comes out. But if you like it to be more chopped, just chop it up. I'm just was like pressed for time. This is the color it should come out. Again, this is with no mayo. You can have this on top of a rice cake. You can have it in a salad with some cranberries, which I'm about to add in. I just wanna make sure this is all mixed. Boom. That's it. So from here, it looks like dirty, uh, <laughs> but it looks good though to me, I don't know. Okay, so right from here, you can add your dried cranberries in. So what I wanted to do is give you guys more of a picture of what to do. So this is your this is your salad, right? You, you got our lettuce here or our mixed greens. So I'm gonna take this and I'm just gonna spray it with a little bit of olive oil. Not the regular olive oil, because guess what? This one, the trick to this is that it is zero calories. Yes, yes, yes. Get into it. I know, get into it. You wouldn't even pay attention to that. No calories, no calories, no calories. A little, a little quick, quick crack of sea salt. Nothing crazy. You can add as much pepper as you like. You are going to put these cranberries inside of the salad. Put it. You can put it in a tuna. I like to put it in the tuna. Oh, I got a runaway cranberry. Oh, yeah. So you're gonna put like maybe like not even a handful, like a grip, <laughs> if that makes sense. And you just gonna stir it in there. Cause for me, this gives me like very sweet and tasty and savory, sweet and savory, just from that. Them cranberries look great. So now all you're gonna do is you are gonna plop this salad right on the top, right? Like so. Look at it, look at it, okay? Now this is this is uh 30 grams of protein for me. I eat two. You don't have to eat two. You can just eat one. You're gonna take some blue cheese. You're gonna take two scoops of the blue cheese and sprinkle it on the top. Two scoops. Sprinkle it on the top. Table two tablespoons, not two scoops. And voila. This is the salad. This looks great to me. Um, real quick, I didn't mention it because I almost forgot that this is one of the key parts of this. You're going to add some candied almonds or no, candy pecans. Pecans into the salad. Just drop them on. Not too many. They are already candy. Don't get too carried away. You can crush them up. And you just lay them on the top. Look how good that looks. That looks amazing, right? Yep. I like to have it um as my like dinner and then right after and my when I say dinner, I eat dinner around like three o'clock. Yeah, three o'clock. And then I have my last protein shake around like five, five thirty, give or take, if I don't have any property showings or anything else I'm doing at the time. So yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a quick recipe for you guys. If you have any questions, drop it down in the comments. Yo, this look good. I don't care what y'all say. <laughs> I'm going to tear it up. But before I do that, I'm going to prep it. I'm going to make two more batches and have it in the fridge until tomorrow and the next day. And the more you prep for your journey, the uh, better prepared you are, um, the more success you have, and the more you uh, minimize things like, oh, let me go to Chick Fil A, or let me go to Wendy's, or whatever those places y'all go. I don't go to I don't go to too many fast food places. I think if I go to Chick Fil A now, the only thing I can have is fries, but I don't even have a desire for that at this point in my journey. Um, but yeah, sometimes I play, but you know, I'm just not right now. I'm fo we focus, we snatching. Yes. So guys, again, if you have any questions, make sure you drop it down in the comments. If you want more recipes or healthy go-to recipes that I use, let me know. I'm happy to help. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. And I will see you guys soon. Until next time, see you later. Bye.